This is Twin Cities Adventures, and in the kitchen today, we're gonna to go harvest a farm fresh egg out of the chicken coop in the backyard, and we're gonna make something really good with it. Okay, she's all done laying. Here we go, one farm fresh egg. First thing you're gonna do is take a medium-sized non-stick skillet, and you're gonna sprinkle about a tablespoon of sugar on the bottom. Then you're gonna take one banana and slice that up. Just like so, and then distribute that onto the pan. Now, if you don't want bananas, you can substitute that for peaches, apples, or any other kind of fruit that you'd like. Now we'll add our farm fresh egg. We'll add a pinch of salt, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and a third cup of sugar. Mix that up. We'll add two thirds cup of milk, a fourth a cup of vegetable oil, give it a mix. In another bowl, you're gonna take one and one fourth cups of white flour and add two teaspoons of baking powder. Mix that up. Then add your egg mixture and give that a mix. Now you're gonna pour that over your bananas. Now I'm gonna just put that on my small burner. I'm gonna cover that. And just put that on low. And I'll come check on that in about 20 minutes. Okay, that has been exactly 20 minutes. Let me turn the oven off for a second. And now we'll take a spatula and just loosen up the edges. And now I'm going to flip this. Okay, that's what that side looks like. Now I'll turn the heat back on. And I'm gonna cook that medium to low for about another five minutes or so. This time we'll cook that uncovered. Okay, that's been about five minutes. I'll turn the heat off. And then we'll bring another plate up here. Now there is a perfectly cooked banana egg cake. We better do a taste test. Mm, that is so good. It's kind of the combination between like a pancake or a banana muffin. That is so good. You could garnish that with a little bit of syrup, a little powdered sugar, or some fresh fruit. That is so delicious. Thanks for watching. Twin Cities Adventures, out.